Hey guys, today we're going to be doing a YouTube video. <laughs> Hello, Farter. Now I'm checking something first. Nope. <laughs> okay, we're going this way then. No, we're not. Hmm. We're going this way. Okay, first thing of business, we are going to talk about a thing. Okay, let me just set up my camera. Okay guys, hello. Now today we're going to be discussing Halloween. 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 Okay, this is my favourite holiday. As you can see by this hat, I'm in the Halloween spirit. I have been for the past month. So we're going to be dressing up. No. <laughs> Addressing up um, the... What costumes have I worn in the past? Okay, so the costumes which I have worn in the past for my past Halloween. The first one I wore... Let me demonstrate. Haha, oh. <laughs> you thought I was going to get dressed for the video? No, I'm not. <laughs> I just climbed up the sofa and jumped down. Okay, so the first order of business <laughs> is I have a cold, so if my voice sounds weird, then sorry. And second order of business is the first... My first ever Halloween, which I remember dressing up as, is I dressed up as a skeleton in a full body skeleton suit, which I remember itched like crazy and I didn't want to wear it. And then when I did wear it, sorry my hair's a mess, minister. And when I did wear it, I remember wanting to take it off instantly, but I decided to wear nothing underneath it. So when I arrived at my friend's party, because every year I go to my friend's party for Halloween, it was so itchy that I just took it off in front of everyone and everyone saw me naked. <laughs> okay, so that was my first party. Halloween thing, you know. Then I remember the next year, my brother dressed up as Mario. Now he's like taller than me, way tall, up to that light, pretty much. And he just dressed up as Mario and it, and then I wanted because he went to a party on the first day of Halloween and then on the next day on Halloween I wanted to dress up as Mario too so they cut off the legs to the Mario outfit and cut off the arms slightly so they would fit me because it was massive and the hat just drooped over my face and I never wore that outfit so we and I wanted to wear that but it didn't fit me anymore so I had to improvise and my dad is really good at making costumes. So he painted my face all white and he dressed me up as a weird ghost lady thing. Yeah, okay. Last year, I'm going to be honest, I can't remember what I dressed up as, like, at all. All I remember was we made some sick pumpkins, which had, like, really cool faces, faces on them. If I can, I'll show you a picture right now. Probably can't, no editing. <laughs> I got your hopes up. Um, then we... And then I remember I dressed up as a zombie bride. This year, however, for Halloween, I'm dressing up as Natsu from Fairy Tale. I know it's different from the other years, like a skeleton, a weird zombie bride thing. I just remembered another outfit. When I was little and three years old, I dressed up as a doggo. I was adorable. <sighs> yes, anyway, and this year I'm dressing up as an outsuit from Fairy Tale because I found an outfit on eBay for only £20 odd. So, yeah, I'm dressing up as an outsuit. Now, I'm going to tell you something. Cameron says in some of the past videos when I've been talking about anime that he hates it. But actually, since we're sharing a YouTube channel now, I can look on his history. Tips for mums if you ever want to see what your child's history is. Just ask to share a channel of them or log on to their cha YouTube channel and then you can look at their history. Simple. So, yeah. And then, um, 
I looked on my history recently, or our history, yeah, and it was my videos, my videos, and then I noticed Fairy Tale Episode 1 English dub. Cameron's been watching some fairy tale, my friends. <laughs> yeah, so now, now you know that Cameron likes it. So, um, that was what I'm going to be dressing up as, just an announcement. You know, I'm going to be the only probably girl dressing up as an anime character for um, Halloween. But still, that was me, and bye.